YouTube what's going on my jewels and gems welcome back to my channel or if this is your first time here welcome welcome thank you for clicking on that uh, thumbnail and um, wanting to hang out with me and see what I got to say so if you are well aware of the title you already know we're gonna be speaking about Carol Baskin now Carol Baskin was very well known and became famous through her appearance on a show called Tiger King with this crazy dude named uh, Joe Exotic. That dude was off the chain. And I don't know if I feel sorry for him during the time that he did because it's not about Carol Baskin what he tried to do to her. I love animals. I'm an animal lover. So since um, a lot of people were saying and he also admitted to, to shooting and killing these animals, I'm not really feeling that. And a lot of people wasn't buying that those animals, those tigers were sick. You know, I, I think he was a mean dude. Just see, from what I saw, he was a mean dude. But anyway, we're here for Cal Baskin. So I got some juice for y'all. I got some tasty juice. Okay, I'm about to pour into y'all cup. So it's recently coming out in the news that um, some articles came out that cadaver dogs found um, smelt human remains on her property. And they are. It's suspected that it may be allegedly her, uh, her, her, her husband, who they declared dead back in 2002, because he went missing in uh, on August 15, 1997. She's been very adamant for years, for years, that she never cleared, that she that she had no idea what happened to her husband, and she had nothing to do with her with his uh, disappearance. A lot of people don't believe her. His daughters, his wife, his ex-wife, and his family, Don Lewis. That's his name. Uh, <clears throat> don't believe her. They are they suing her right now. They also stated in Tiger King that how they very they were very fearful fearful of her. And Don Lewis also said that he was scared of her too because he took out um, two months prior to his death he took out a restraining order on her behind. See now she looks all innocent and those be the ones that be like you have to watch out for. I'm always hearing that, but I think there's some truth to that. So there's gonna be a new show coming on, um, airing on ID channel. So if you are a fan of the ID channel, you stay watching the ID channel, then I'm putting y'all on to, to this new show. It's called Tigers, Lies, and Cover Ups. So this will uncover uh, um, several new details um, allegedly re um, revolving around Don Lewis' um, um, disappearance. There's this ex-Secret uh, Service agent. He's retired. He's a retired homicide detective. His name is Jim Rat Rat Ratman. He was he was conducting a long time. He's he's, con he's conducting this show, and. Uh, conducting this case and he said his um on you know on the property his dogs picked up a, a human scent picked up human remains scent now the the condition of the area because this is in um brandon florida the condition because it's been it's been years it's been so long that it's kind of as bad it's water muddy it's just not good condition so for him to to really get uh get true confirmation and to bring back the dogs to really to know what really is going on he has to drain out the area drain out the water and everything like that and clean up the area to then do another thorough search and bring back the dogs because he says that when dogs pick up a scent they could smell a scent from 20 meters away so if a, if a dog is smelling something and they're letting us know then there's something there and we can't just ignore that situation i won't neither so carol will be she will be facing with this situation now she will be facing hours of questioning from civil lawyers which can lead to criminal a criminal interview so <laughs> this is not looking good for carol um she's been recently on dancing with the stars i'm gonna post a picture of her <laughs> Getting her dance on, man. I'm telling you, if 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 it comes if it comes to the if it comes down to her actually killing her husband and it's actually proven, I wonder what kind of dancing she gonna be doing with them inmates. Some dirty dancing. We just wanna know. Anyway, so um, Jim reveals how another possible burial. The first property he believed uh, Don Lewis um, bodies buried is on in, on his lake near his lake house. So the second property where he believes that his remains can be possibly uh, would be his uh, under a skeptic tank. So the second burial would be under the skeptic tank, you know, um, at Animal Rescue Life on Easy Street, which is now renamed Big Cat Rescue. Jim allegedly uncovered permits issued two weeks before Don's death and, and receipts 
had showed tanks were delivered on August 14th, a day before Don went missing. So Jim also raised concerns about, about the van that was last uh, that was the last car that Don was driving and he just left it and found he just like left it and and it was nearby a, um, a airfield so it's like how he's going to just up and leave and not tell nobody anything so a lot of people are very suspicious about that because that's not normal behavior and um so the last person to see him was um his his assistant named ann ann mcqueen now ann mcqueen was his trusted assistant she'd been his assistant for years and he confided in her and all and like i said before he told her that he, he feared for his life and and be and before the last words he told her was he would contact her later that day and he never contacted her and she never heard from him ever, 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 ever again. So that left her highly suspicious and she truly believes something happened to Don. Do you believe something happened to Don? Because I believe he, I raised my hand. I believe he, I believe something happened to Don Lewis. Carol, girl, we need, we, we want to know. We want to know. We want to know. So yeah so she definitely believes something happened to him so this is some interesting news you know um so i just want to bring this to you guys because i'm not sure if you guys would uh want to know more about the story but if you do then yeah so there will be new details new uncoveries and new revelations behind don lewis death because everybody want to know carol baskin did you chop up your husband put him in the meat grinder and then spread his meat and spread his body parts all over the place what's going on okay we we want to know okay we want to know so anyway y'all like comment subscribe um, tell me if you believe Carol Baskin is innocent. Do you feel she's innocent? Do you think she's guilty? I'm all ears. All right. So <laughs> I'll catch y'all in another video. Peace.